try to show you how to connect your little cheap quads to the Mi Wi-Fi extender. As you can see, the light's blue because it's already synced up. So I have to go ahead and disconnect it first. So first thing I'll do is take a little pin or something that can get into that reset button. Let's see if you can see this. And so I hold it in there. This blue light right now. It should go out. It went out. It means it's reset and now it's orange. So it's ready to bind. So now I'll put it back up here. And now we'll go ahead and go into the app and start to configure. Okay, so we're in the Mi app. I've already logged in. So what we'll do is go ahead and go into profile and then settings. And look at the bottom, I have US server. So we'll go back. And again, I'm showing you the wrong way first. And we'll add device. And we'll go devices nearby. And we'll see if it picks up this Wi-Fi extender. It did not. So we'll go back, try it one more time. Add device. Device is nearby. All right, it's not going to pick it up. So what we have to do is you got to go back into profile settings and select mainland China. For some reason, it doesn't give you all the all the right devices when you choose US. So we'll log in again. And the Wi-Fi I'm connected to is my home Wi-Fi, so that's how I'm able to do the internet using that Wi-Fi. I'm not connected to the quad. And now we'll go into profile just to verify settings and we are now mainland China so we'll go to add device again and see a whole lot more devices show up so we'll go devices nearby it sees it now the repeater so we'll click it and what device do you want to use and it's the Hubson so we'll go ahead and hit the three dots on the right and put the password in Five, six, seven, eight. It might automatically ask you for it, but since I've connected to this before, uh, I'm just showing you how you can put the password in. Hit next. And now it's trying to connect to the device. It connected, sent a message to the device, and it should be connecting to it. And if it fails, don't worry about it because it probably still went through. And we'll see. Because it's trying to connect the device to the network. And let's see what network I'm hooked to. I'm connected to the Hubson, so I don't have a network for it to hook to right now. So that probably should time out. But we'll go ahead in the network and connect to the Plus. So it did work. But again, it's not going to connect to a network because I'm connected to the quad. And the quad has no internet. So what we'll do is we'll go into plus. So it's the Hubson, all that same 216 jazz, and then plus. And then we'll put the password in. Same as before. Hit connect. And it should go off of the quad. Now it's using the router. And now we'll go into the Hubson app. And now we see it. There we go. To get this thing connected, as you can see, I have the blue light. Let's see if you can see it here. The blue light is on. That means you're connected. And um, it's ready to fly. So you can do this with other little cheap quads that um, 
have Wi-Fi FPV and it makes it a lot more enjoyable when you can fly them a little farther out, a little higher. And uh, if you like the video, please like and subscribe and thanks for watching.